I know y'all can see what's on the screen. Welcome back to The Walking Dead, but this time we are on season two. This is one of my favorite games of all time. This is the first game that I got on my PlayStation Vita, and I played the crap out of this game. There was not a single day when I didn't complete the main story, okay? I played this game at least 20 times. At least 20 times. At least. That is the least that I've played this game. I'm going to be honest, this is one of my favorite games. I've already said that. But this is one of my favorite games of all time, and I'm so happy to be back. So let's get into it with season two, baby. Previously on The Walking Dead. What's your name? I'm Clementine. You've been all by yourself through this? I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. Lee, did you have to kill those men? Yes. It's crazy all the things that Clementine has went through at such a young age. All the losses, the deaths you know that she had her. to deal with, the trauma. I, I, I can't lie, I didn't really raise her right. Molly said Crawford is the only place left in Savannah that still has people. That means it must be where my mom and dad are. Okay. She's seen her own parents walking around as decaying corpses. Clementine! Okay. Clementine! Yikes, man. I hated this dude. Glad I killed him. Lee, I saw my parents. I know. You have to shoot me, honey. Lee, no. But don't need it, Krista. I didn't want to see that scene again. I didn't. I'm going to just be honest. I didn't want to see that scene again, man. What do you think? Oh, Mage, you can't be serious. I am. We are not doing that. Why not? Because. Come on, Krista. What's wrong with Omid? We're not calling our baby Omid. One of you is enough. Clementine, a little help here? Omid is a decent Omid name. I sick. can't lie. No. Omid is a good name. I like it. Thank you, Clementine. You always agree with him. Because I'm always right. You're not taking this seriously. I take everything seriously. Especially little Omid's future. Keep talking, and you'll be sleeping in the rain tonight. Remember that time in Barstow? Vegas weekend? Why don't you, uh, uh, get cleaned up in the girls' room, Clem? I hope the sink works in there. I wouldn't count on it. Just be careful and make sure to keep track of your things. We'll be right next door. Okay. Stay safe in there, Clementine. To this day, I don't understand why Hello? they left Clementine alone. Why couldn't they just go with her? It's like one of the stupidest mistakes that you can ever make. Oh, gross. Ugh, what's that? Phew. 
Good. No one's here. Guess it's safe to get cleaned up. Yeah, I know, Clementine. It's disgusting in here. Please have water. Don't count on it. Yeah, sorry, little Clem. I wouldn't even use the water bottle. Look at this scoundrel. Oh, get your gun, Clem. This never would have happened if Omid and Crystal would have went in here with me. I see you. Get out yeah, of here. you got eyes. Of You're course you'll be able to see me, you dummy. Who are you? None of your business. Are you gonna hurt me? Only if you're stupid. Get out here. You got anything on you? Come on, let's see. No. It's all I it's have. All I have. That's it? How'd you make it this long? I'm serious. What else you got? That's it. Don't lie to me. I'll pop you. She is bullying an nine-year-old girl, dude. I'm not walk away. Come on. Just walk away. Whatever. Give me that hat. No. Where'd you get it? Don't trip on I it, I asked huh? you a question. My dad gave it to me. Just give it to me. Junk, junk, junk. Look at all this junk. Shit, shit, and more shit. Why you ain't got nothing good? Probably because I'm a nine-year-old girl life. surviving they with only three people. Ever thought about that? That was a good catch. You ain't got nothing good. You just a little fish. Duh. You gonna cry, little fish? This your daddy? What a bozo. Are you kidding me? You just disrespected Lee's entire name. <laughs> oh, me done got himself popped, man. Crystal pop this mug, man. I didn't mean to. I didn't, I mean, didn't to. mean to. If you don't bust her. I didn't mean to. Yeah. Now you so sorry. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to. I was just so tough at first. Sucks to suck, man. Should have kept that pistol on you.
Krista, talk to me. will never work. Look at this. It's pathetic. The wood's too wet to burn. It's more smoke than flame. Keep trying. There's only so much I can do. You should be doing this, not me. Tending a fire so you can cook and stay warm. It's something you have to be able to do, Clementine. Otherwise... Omid said that- I know what Omid said. Dang! I'm just trying to lighten up the mood, yeah. I'm freezing. You think this is bad? Wait till we get up to Wellington. Then talk to me about cold. If we make it. We still have a couple hard months ahead of us. This rain will turn to sleet. Then ice. Then snow. It won't be easy. Is it safe there? Safer than here because of the cold, or so they say. We just need Who to is keep they? moving north. We need to get to Wellington. We'll try the best we can. I'm gonna go look for more wood. You just keep the fire lit. I'm gonna try. I mean, y'all eating squirrel on a stick. How hard can that possibly be to burn, eh? Gosh. All right, let's see. Uh, I see. I literally refuse. I refuse to burn this picture, of Lee. I refuse. Enough. The flames are too low. This might burn. I refuse to burn the pictures. We're not even going to be able to stay here for much longer. Yeah, see? <sighs> Some idiot scavenger. These aren't even scavengers. These are raiders. Rude. Mean. Cold blooded killers. Don't fucking lie to us. You get the truth. You must get the truth and you don't get hurt. 
you with me? Where's the rest of your group? I, I'm by myself. Bullshit. She's lying. Cut the shit, lady. It's it's just me. Come on, guys. <laughs> what the Krista, fuck? Run! Peeked him right in the head. Hey. <laughs> Krista is dead. Y'all heard that? Krista is dead. Mm, brother, I'm gone. You are not gonna be able to catch me. Krista, are you there? Krista is dead. Ah. 
ain't no more Krista. It's the ghost of Krista now. What does this say? It says, beware of your surroundings. All of those animals have gone extinct by now. Come on now. Oh my gosh, <laughs> that Loki just frightened me. you find boy where are you going wait up Honestly, I think this is where his owners were, but they probably got Stay ate some by some zombies, so. Let's take a look at what we're looking for. Let's take a look at what we're looking for. Looks like they were a happy family once. I hope they left some food behind somewhere. Hmm, nothing edible. The dog walking over here Man. like, you gonna give me some of this food. Now I just need hmm, something to open it with. Hey 
Hey, boy. What's the matter? have to be quiet. Aw, oh, man. Gruesome sight. It's this okay. is probably one of his He's homies, dead. too. Look, you can see the bite. Looks like he tried to cut it out. But that never works. Did a terrible job. Dog, if you don't shut the freak up... It's okay. We're smart. He's not. We're smarter than all of them. Except for when they move in packs. When they when they move when they move in hordes, they're probably the smartest thing ever. I do the same thing twice, knowing the outcome. Hold on. Let me get like a, a tree branch. There we go. Okay. I, I real talk believe that I can complete this game with one hand. That's how many times I played it. I haven't played it in a while though. But I, uh, you know, love this game, dude. He's still not dead? Gosh. See, we just have to stay out of their reach. I like to think that if they were alive, they'd probably want to help you. Nothing. It's a shame, though. What this world has come to. I'm about to use this dirty knife to cut open a can of beans and I'm finna go eat it. And this dog is gonna want some. Beans probably like three years old. Please don't be bad. Yeah, Clem, eat up and stay the freak away from me. I guess you're pretty hungry too. Dog gonna be greedy. Watch this. Watch. Here you go. Hey, you don't eat it all. Look at it. Oh, for some beans. Get off me, man. Awful can of beans, dude. That dirty dog. <sighs> You know what? Frack him. I'm about to leave him here to suffer. Frack this stupid dog. Think about your actions, punk. I'm sorry. Never should have been greedy for them beans, boy. You would have been a great companion. Would have been a great companion.
hardcore clan, man. All the stuff she went through. Couldn't even... She couldn't even eat a can of beans by herself. 16 months ago, she watched Omi die. And now Krista? Ah, uh, man, we always getting tackled by some stupid zombie. I'm out. Grab her. Let's go. Come on, kid. You gotta get I think, I think we're safe. Yeah, yeah, we're good. Hey, you all right? No, I just got my can of beans stolen. And ate in my face, and then I just got bit by a dog. Left it there to freaking die. What are you doing out here? Where are the, uh, the people you're with? There's no chance you made it this long on your own. My friend and I got attacked. Hmm. These folks mention what they were after? They might have just wanted food. We were cooking some sort of weasel. They attacked you for a weasel? Damn. That is low. They didn't mention any names, right? They weren't searching for anybody? Yeah, I know exactly who they're worried about. <clears throat> Starts with the C, well, ends with an R. I'm Luke. Good. This is Pete. Hey there. Hi, I'm Clementine. And it's nice to meet you, Clementine. But for now, we're gonna take you back to our group. And we got a doctor with us, and you look like you could use some. Oh shit! Gosh. What? What is it? She's, she's been bit, man. Fuck, 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 fuck. What are we gonna do here? No, it was a dog. I didn't see any dog, Clementine. Come on, kid. We just saw you with those lurkers back there. I can't remember the last time I saw a dog. So what do we do now? It was. I swear. Swearing doesn't make something so... No, no, no. I'm telling you the truth. Please. Hmm. All right. Let's see. It. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, watch yourself. Hey, don't look at me like that. You're the one that's been here, okay? Is it, uh, is it like she says? Well, it could be a dog. Hard to say. So where'd this dog go? I left it to oh, die. What, what, what does that matter, Pete? Seriously. He, he ran off. So a dog runs up, bites you, and then runs off. Just some asshole dog in the forest. It wanted my food. <laughs> what? Did you expect it to stick around? I don't know. Clementine? Yes? You telling us the truth? You look me in the eyes when you answer. Yes. All right, Clementine. That's good enough for me. Well, what else was she going to say? I've got a good bullshit detector, Luke. That's why you can never <laughs> you don't always beat me at it. Alright, how can you be sure? Well, I'm sure I ain't willing to leave a little girl in the woods to die when we got a doctor with 
scientist that can make a call. We can have Carlos take a look at it first. Nick ain't gonna like this. Not with what happened. You don't have to remind me of that, boy. Right. Sorry, sir. Come on. Clementine, are you feeling all right? I'm fine. Just tired. Well, you better be fine, because I ain't carrying you anymore with that bite on your arm. <laughs> Don't worry about Dude is not playing. He is not trying to get bit. Oh, shit. Looks like you're gonna have to carry me. Probably actually dragged me all the way here. Then she was bitten by a dog. What? And you just believed her? You should have put her out of her misery right there. Dog bite my ass. I'm not. <gasps> Dude, what the? Keep your finger off the trigger, boy. Whoa! Whoa! What the fuck? You idiot! Every lurker for five miles probably heard You're the that. one telling me to fucking shoot her. Everybody, just calm down for a second. Clementine, you okay? I'm not. I'm not working for anyone. Oh, I don't know what you're talking about. I just need help. We got a doctor right here. Okay, he'll have a look. You know what the hell is wrong with you people? Okay, she's just scared. We're all scared, Luke. Don't act like we're the ones being irrational because we don't buy this bullshit story. No way she survived out here on her own. Why are we even arguing I about I told y'all. Let me take a look. I was with two other people. Well, actually one because 16 months ago he died. It's okay. Go ahead. He's a doctor. Damn, that must have hurt. Hmm. Whatever it was, it got you good. This isn't how we do things, man. When you're bit, you get put down. End of story. I'm not going through this again. No one's suggesting that. We could take her arm off. <gasps> uh, I know that worked for a cousin down in Ainsworth. We could try that. It won't do any good. You'll just be making it worse for the girl. It's crazy. No one's going to volunteer to do that. I would, if it means saving her life. Then what? How would we know it worked? Just let Carlos have a look first. Who's she? Sarah, what they say, stay inside. It really, really hurts. And it's only gonna get worse. A dog, you say? Do you think it could have had rabies? Out here? Who knows? Right now, that's the least of your concerns. Carlos, we've been through this before. We all agree. We don't wait for shit like this. End of story. So, what do you think? Was it a lurker? A bite like that? Could be anything. Only one way to find out. How? Oh. We wait. What? By tomorrow morning, if the fever set in, we'll know if she's gonna turn. In the meantime, we can lock her in the shed. <laughs> They're doing Clem dirty. What about my arm? It needs to get cleaned and, and stitched and bandaged. The girl is in bad shape, Carlos. But we have all that stuff inside the cabin. We could probably get by Alvin, with it. please. But yeah, we can't do nothing. I'm not wasting supplies on a lurker bite. If it turns out you're telling the truth, I'll clean it and stitch it up for you in the morning. But... I'm sorry. It's the best we're gonna get. Finger off the trigger, son. I ain't your son. Don't be like that, man. Gosh, right. this dude got some Boys real got issues. Temper. Come on. This is just a waste of time. You'll see. And when she turns, I ain't gonna be the one cleaning up the ship. 
It was a dog. You'll see. I guess we'll find out in the morning. If I last that long, maybe you could go look for it? I wish I could. I really do, but it's too risky. Sorry. Look for the dog, Clem? Are you crazy? Is you crazy? And do what with it? Eat it? Harsh. I'll admit it's harsh what they're doing to you. You'll be alright though, Clint. Just remember that. Hmm. Okay, through here. If I remember appropriately. Not much left in here. I guess if I have to, I can use this for stitches. Okay, mm. that's not gonna work. I need to get the hammer up there, though. Or maybe I can use the knife. Nah, I gotta get the hammer, I remember. Find a way into the cabin and obtain a noodle, peroxide, and some bandages. That is going to be extremely easy. So, let's get to work, shall we? Now, if I remember appropriately, and I do remember appropriately, <laughs> there is a board right here that I have to crawl under. I'm pretty sure this actually breaks, but it opens it. Yeah, yeah, it does. Okay. Well, Luke has more to say, I guess. Where's Sarah? She's got her book. She doesn't need to be a part of it. I want to listen in on what they're saying. Just, just to be nosy on the... On the nosy side.
Yeah, I'm about to, I'm about to take a little peek in here. You know, feel me? No way. She could be. We don't know. She's connected to somebody. There's no way that They think I'm a part of Carver. Whoever she's with, they'll probably come looking for her. Great. They show up and we've got her locked in shit. You think we should bring her in here? No, I'm just saying it wouldn't look too good. They really think they're paranoid. That's what it is. You really think Carver would come after us? You think he wouldn't? He's not exactly the type to let things lie. What happened, happened. There's nothing we can do about it now. Let him come. I really don't give a damn. Okay, Alvin got some personal beef with Carver. Oh, well, what is it making me do? Let me listen in. That honestly looked like Kenny. About to get eaten alive, and you're telling us it was a dog? Yeah, yeah, I know it sounds crazy, but look, for whatever reason, I think she's telling the truth. Look, there's no point in arguing about it now. She's in the shed, she's not gonna hurt anyone. We'll just see what's what in the morning. But Carlos said she could die if she doesn't get her arm treated. Assuming she doesn't turn. Is that true? The girl could really die. If the infection spreads, anything's possible. Don't we have penicillin? Or something that can, you know, stop the infection from spreading? We have some, but not enough to spare. We're not wasting anything on her. What if one of us... Look, okay. Luke and the other dude, I forgot his name, are the only people that are really taking up for me. Carlos is sort of in the middle. He doesn't know where to stand. So I gotta remember that. They some real ones. Alright, enough with being nosy. We are going to go upstairs now. Oops, I went the wrong way. Great time to meet Sarah. You're not supposed to be in here. Hi. Can you please help me? I'm not supposed to talk to you. My dad can't know. Help me, and I won't tell him. I... I'm hurt. Please help me. I, well, I shouldn't. To you. A dog bit me. Sounds scary. I bet it hurts. Oh, it did. I could die if I don't take care. 
care of it. Do you understand? I need something to clean it with, bandages, and I need to sew some of it up. It's too deep. My dad says we're out of real bandages, but I know where to get something to clean it. That's what this applies. I'll help you. Good. Thank you. I'm Sarah. I'm Clementine. We're friends. Right? We can be best friends. I haven't met another girl my age since way before. It's hard to be the only girl, you know? Rebecca is okay, but she's old. And that's it. Yes. We are friends. Promise? It's important. Friends have to trust each other, no matter what. I promise. Me too. Friends. Pinky swears forever. I'll see if I can find the stuff my dad uses when I get a cut. Let me look around. W, Sarah. For now. That'll work. You can't do it here, though. Someone will find you. Don't worry. I won't. Thanks, Sarah. Clean. We'll still need some bandages, though. Yikes, um, I to go hide in the shower. This baby. <laughs> Let it be okay. Let it be his. Yikes, y'all. Yikes. Alright, YouTube. I think I'm going to stitch this dog bite up on the next episode. So if y'all enjoyed this one, make sure you like and subscribe. I'll catch y'all in the next episode, man. Peace out, y'all.